quirks and quarks. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today we're tackling a famous quote attributed to the genius himself, Albert Einstein. If you can't explain it to a six-year-old, you don't understand it well enough. It's a powerful message about clear communication. But did Einstein actually say it? And is there a twist to the story? Buckle up, because we're about to debunk a myth. Einstein was known for his revolutionary theories, most of which confirmed over and over by countless successful experiments, but also for his ability to explain complex ideas in a relatable way. This likely fueled the popularity of the quote. However, here's the surprising truth. There's no official source for Einstein ever saying those exact words. That's right. Researchers haven't found any writings or documented speeches by Einstein containing that specific quote. So where does this famous quote come from? Here's the thing. Similar sentiments were expressed by other scientists. For example, physicist Ernest Rutherford supposedly said a scientific discovery wasn't valid unless a barmaid could understand it. It's easy to see how in today's day and age, such a statement would sound both wrong and discriminatory. But the idea of explaining things simply has a long history, though there's a crucial point often missed. Einstein's own work, particularly relativity, is notoriously complex. It relies heavily on advanced mathematics. So could a six-year-old truly grasp it, even with the best explanation? Probably not. In 1932, physicist Louis de Broglie recounted a conversation with Einstein about quantum mechanics. Apparently, Einstein admitted he disliked the theory's reliance on probability and said something along the lines of, you haven't truly understood something until you can explain it without resorting to statistics. This second-hand quote from de Broglie suggests Einstein valued a deep and factual grasp of a concept not necessarily a simplified explanation for a child. So what's the takeaway? The spirit of the quote, clear communication, is valuable. But there's a limit, especially with highly complex scientific ideas. Here's the important warning about simplification. Oversimplification can be a dangerous game. Stripping away too much nuance can alter the original concept so much that it ends up working against it even creating false statements. There's a sweet spot. Strive to simplify concepts only to one step before the simplification renders them incorrect. This allows you to explain complex ideas in a way that's engaging while avoiding dangerous misinformation. Science communicators today are masters at this. They use analogies, visualizations, and age-appropriate language to spark curiosity, not dumb things down. Just a couple of examples of great scientific communication. Go watch the videos from SciShow or PBS Spacetime. I'll put the links in the description below. In conclusion, my friends, the next time you hear that Einstein quote, remember the context. There is no official record of Einstein saying it himself. And the closest thing we have is a secondhand quote about a different concept entirely. While clear communication is key, some things require and are worthy of a deeper dive. Thanks for joining us. Let us know in the comments what complex topics you'd love to see explained in a fun way. Until next time, stay curious.